want to know who Earth's cousin is, then this video is the right one for you. <laughs> These country balls never get old. I love how they all bounce around with little flags. They're so dramatic for no reason. Look at those two arguing over just a slice of pizza. Relatable. I still think the physics in these are completely wrong. But it's just a good thing. At least they've got more personality than all gas joints. <sighs> no offense. Huh? Who's calling now? Oh! Is that another monkey planet? Or a gas giant? Or a moon? Or a dwarf planet? It says. Objective 452b. Isn't it an exoplanet, Mercury? That's way outside our solar system. Exactly why we should answer to meet new people like us. Hey everyone, I'm Kepler 452b. But you can call me Kepler. I'm an exoplanet about 1,400 light years from Earth. Basically Earth, but just a bit older, bigger, and way more advanced. Advanced? You're not even in our solar system. What makes you so special? Hold up, wait a minute. You're Earth-like? How is that possible being so far out? I orbit a star pretty similar to your sun, but it's about 1.5 billion years older. I complete an orbit every 385 days, and I'm about 60% bigger than Earth. That would affect your gravity and temperature balance. Interesting orbital physics. Exactly. I'm kind of a master of stability, and let's be real, I'm a prime candidate for us. Wow! Do you really think there could be life on your surface? Maybe not yet, but one day with the right research, who knows? I've got the atmosphere, the distance from my star, and all the right ingredients. I've got a thick atmosphere too. It makes me the hottest one here. Yeah, but you're like a lava sauna. I've got ice caps. That's way cooler. Don't worry. Worry boys, you got all your charm, but let's be honest, I might just be the future. There's still a lot we don't understand about exoplanets like you. That's kind of inspiring. Yup. Anyways, gotta go. See ya. Well, that was something, right guys?